Hi, Tom and Ryan from Kid Me Motorsports here again. And today we've got a customer who's come back. We've done some performance work for him in the past, and uh, he wants to make it go a little faster now. Um, when he was here last time, we put the TJ Power Sports stock uh, performance exhaust on here. Works like a charm. Uh, cut down the sound quite a bit. And we're actually going to do a DR pulley uni hitch clutch and CDI and enhanced coil. This is an awesome clutch and it works on the CF Moto and the CN250 or many of them anyways. Um, give us a call or check us out at kiddingmeparts.com or give us a call at 717-825-0669 and we'll hook you up. Alright, we've already taken off the CVT cover and I've removed the belt. And by the way, on the Joiner 250, the particular belt is the an 868 by 24.2. That's handy to know if you ever need to replace your belt. Um, we've already taken off the bolts on the outside of it. This is the variator side here, and this is the clutch side. And this is the part that we're going to replace now. Now, after taking the bolt off the outside, the bell housing slides right off. Then the clutch and pulley system is all in one piece. Just kind of give that a little wiggle and the whole thing will come off. Now there's a trick to getting this nut off of here. There's a spring, a torque spring, in between the clutch and the slide face pulley. It's under tension. The best way to do that, to get this nut off of here, on the end, it's an inch and a half on this particular model, the best way to get that nut off of there, we found, is to set it on the ground, place your foot on either side of the clutch. You'll need an impact wrench with an inch and a half socket. And put a little bit of force down on it so when you get that nut off, the clutch doesn't shoot up at you. Okay, once you take the nut off, then let your feet off slowly to release the pressure and you've got your spring set up and then the clutch comes right off the top just like that open up the box and your clutch is inside this is the most tunable clutch on the market um, we've gotten great results with it and if you're racing you've got to have this clutch now the Dr. Pulley Hot Clutch comes with four different sets of springs now when we're going to put it in for this customer, he's decided he just wanted us to keep it with the stock springs that are in it and he'll do the tuning himself once he gets it back home. And put it right back on where your other clutch came off. Now you'll notice that it's actually keyed, it's not a perfect round hole. It'll fit on the top of this also keyed. And just reverse the process when we put it on or when we took it off. Put your feet on top of the clutch. Push it back down over top of the key. Put your inch and a half nut back on. Once you get the clutch installed, back on the way that you had the original one, put your pulley back on. Then your bell housing goes back on after that. Make sure that goes all the way on. It's got threads on it. And then your bolt on the outside. Make sure you tighten this all up. Put your belt back on, put your cover back on, and you're done. We've got everything, MRP and DR pulley. We've got uni hit clutches. We've got uni variators. We've got belts, rollers, sliders, hot coils. We got variators from MRP. We got a uh, sand painted variator, really good grip, brand new item. You want to check that out for your GY6150. We've got Melosi clutches. We've got um, a, an upgrade to the standard GY6 clutch, which is really nice. We've got clutch bells, uh, all sorts of accessories, sprockets, anything you need. To make your buggy best at almost anything. Just call 717-825-0669 and we'll get you hooked up. So visit us at KidMeCarts.com. That's K-I-D.
N-M-E-M-O-T-O-R.com. How could you spell motor when it's kidding me carts? <laughs>